before we go on with this video i do want to let you guys know that it is sponsored by cod mobile so that's a shout out to cod mobile for sponsoring today's video with that being said let's go ahead and check out the jack 12 and see how you can make it absolutely nutty all right so i've been messing around with the jack 12 and the different attachments on it just trying to see exactly like what the different variants are of this weapon and obviously it has two primary or i guess three primary ways to be played and that is just a typical shotgun that just sprays a bunch of pellets super fast or you can use slugs which still shoot super fast uh, which you can see i have equipped right here and then the third primary option is going to be the frag attachment which i've been playing around with a little bit and i don't like it maybe there's a way to make it work really good i would assume probably in some kind of like objective based modes like hardpoint domination uh shooting cars is super broken though with this because you can shoot it from like pretty far away and it'll explode which is kind of nutty but i don't know apart from that i don't really like it thus far but again probably some way to make it work but dude the slug reload is kind of nutty in terms of like the paper stats i haven't played with it yet but that's what we're going to be doing inside of this video but in terms of what this is capable of it is nuts so just a quick breakdown on what the attachment does obviously it converts the weapon from being a pellet based weapon to a slug round so basically what you're going to be getting is extra damage and damage range but you're going to be losing all of your pellets except for one which again basically just makes it a slug round so with this attachment and some range extension it is absolutely insane the potential time to kills you can be getting oh i had a burp sorry but yeah potential time to kills on this are nuts i'll go ahead and show you guys right now so just a quick stat on this weapon i haven't tested all of the stats i've just looked at the fire rate of the weapon it has a fire rate of 328 rounds per minute for comparison the semi-automatic amax has a peak fire rate of 275 uh the dr8 shoots at 568 so it's kind of in between those two but something to note is the jack 12 is fully automatic but anyway with the slug rounds the damage that you're going to be getting with this weapon at super close range is going to be 77 damage so obviously a two shot kill one shot kill if you're able to hit the head and it would be overkill by a huge margin by the way too so good chance you could actually probably um well no i guess shotguns don't actually uh go through materials so no never mind you could you couldn't wall bang headshot but anyway this weapon is going to be a two shot with slug rounds at basically all ranges so if we go all the way to 40 meters our damage is going to go down but it's still going to be a two shot so we're going to be getting 65 damage at this range and then to the head let me reload 143 damage so again way overkill so even at the like longest ranges of uh about 50 meters right here we're still going to be getting 65 obviously in the training room i can only go so far so i can't see like what the maximum or minimum damage is on this gun but even at this range we're getting 65 damage so i'm gonna assume 65 is the lowest amount of damage you can get with the slug rounds but again i have no idea but how often you're going to be using this gun beyond you know 60 meters anyway so as a two shot if you're able to hit both shots the time to kill is 183 milliseconds and that goes all the way up again to 60 meters and maybe even beyond now obviously it's a shotgun it's not going to be easy to do that but even at like 20 meters it is not that hard at least on this target with some um bullet or ads bullet spread attachments on to hit a two shot it's really not just boom 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 and it sprays crazy fast too now keep in mind if you do miss your uh second shot and you have the three shot your time to kill is going to jump up to 360 milliseconds but for a shotgun at you know 20 30 meters that is still really good like i struggle to even call this thing a shotgun when you build it like this because it's fully automatic it's shooting one bullet it's it's basically just a slow firing like ar or something at this point to be honest like there's no real shotgun qualities at this point in terms of the hip fire spread i'll go ahead and shoot the target like this again we are currently at all right, 25 meters, hit fire, one pellet there, one pellet there, one pellet there. So as you can tell, like a pretty tight spread. Like if I'm hit firing the character at this range, I don't think, here, let's, let's do 10 shots and see how many hit. So he is right in the center. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. So six out of 10 shots connected at 25 meters hip firing with this build specifically. So that is not hard. And again, it's not a moving target. So we're gonna have to get gameplay to really see how this feels. But on paper, the fact you can get 183 uh, millisecond time to kill up to potentially infinite range is nuts. But again, as we know, on paper doesn't necessarily translate to in game. So now let's go ahead and hop into some rank and see what I can actually do with this thing inside of probably domination or hardpoint. Havik, please, come on. Obviously with this build, like you're not gonna be getting incredible ADS time. Like that's that's pretty damn slow, but because the ADS or the, the hip fire is so good, it doesn't matter that much because you can start shooting as you're ADSing and still be relatively accurate. So that's something to keep in mind. Okay, so that was like a three shot, but you can tell it still worked out pretty fine. A slide of hand on this build might not be a bad idea considering you're stuck with eight shots when you do use the slug reload. 
uh, reload. But one thing I want to try. Yeah, bro. This thing is literally just, you're turning the shotgun into an AR, which is pretty nuts to even think about. Okay, that was just bad aim right there. That wasn't the gun. Nice. Reload. Yeah, so like you definitely need vulture probably with this and um, sleight of hand wouldn't be a bad idea either just because the mag is pretty tough to deal with. So the, the way it shoots is going to feel really weird. It's, it's not very fast firing, but if you can do something like that, sheesh. I'm hearing footsteps for you. There's one. Is there a guy on my right? Oh. <laughs> See, the fact you can do that is just so dumb. <laughs> Did that guy get a chopper gun or a stealth chopper? I don't actually know the difference in terms of the visual. No. All right, here he can't hit me. Or he can? Okay. I can't believe he got that from a freaking... Dude, that guy got that from a care package. Those gotta be explosive rounds. Cool. Oh, no. Come on. Nice. Yo, that was scuffed. Okay, bro. This is where we start streaking here a little bit. Oh, no. Okay, of course I said I'm gonna die right after. <laughs> All right, well, that game was chalked because I got a chopper gunner inside of the, the crate and then also crash. And also, I don't think my builder's right. So we're gonna try that again because I think this can be much better. All right, let's tweak this thing up a bit. So number one, uh, Martyr Suppressor. Uh, maybe go choke instead. I think that might be the better move, especially because damage range might not even matter at all. Like if damage range doesn't here let's let's go do this real quick let's take marksman off and just do choke off as well and see what our range looks like now because i think we were overkill on the range okay we're getting 77 let's go 40 66 65 oh it might go from 66 to 65 and then yeah so i mean we're still one shotting with those attachments off so i don't think damage range is actually useful at all because you're still always getting the same time to kills i mean assuming like the person isn't low or you know you're wall banging but i'm pretty sure shotguns don't wall bang anyway so like i don't think it's worth it to use range extension attachments at all so we can actually maybe build this thing with a lot more ads speed uh better on like whatever we want how whatever our issues were we should be able to correct them so slug reload uh i'm gonna go owc laser don't think hit, if we're gonna go ads speed then hit fire doesn't matter too much but i might go throw on something like a uh okay merc foregrip doesn't actually do uh hit fire on this so maybe first obviously slide a hand granulated i think i'm happy with stocks uh vertical recoil was something i had issues with so let's adjust that i'm fun losing some movement speed that should be good all right so maybe this all we're really losing is movement speed yeah let's try this out and then i'm gonna go with uh whatever it's called too vulture or we could do quick fix with the box um yeah we'll try that instead munitions box and go back to quick fix it's because it is still a shotgun so i like having quick fix on all right let's try this out because this this might be the way to play it all right, what do we got? Hardpoint crossfire, bro. I'm getting the biggest maps. What is this? Our ADS speed is way snappier. And we should not have any issues getting the same kind of time to kills. Yeah. We'll see though, we'll see. I might like go on a heady or something and uh, cover the hard point. I think that's kind of the play style we're gonna have here. There's one. Get a reload. Okay. Saw another guy. Oh, nice teammate. Yeah, like maybe just hold something like this. Try to cover the point. I want to try this thing at a little bit longer ranges. Oh, <laughs> that's what I was hoping for. Okay, now this thing is doing what I wanted to. UAV. Start getting a little bit more aggressive here. Oh, that was way too close. Where'd that guy go? Chase. Nice, there's one. Go back down. Rotate it on the heady. Got plenty of ammo right now. Nice. Nice. We got the advance. Pop that. All right. Now we got to go for next point, which is going to be tough. Also going to throw down munitions. Might be a waste, but I don't know if it stacks up. Okay. We're, yeah, we're at 61. So yeah, munitions is the way to run this thing. Let's try to get high ground here. Play this like a sniper. <laughs> That's so dumb. It's hard, but it's dumb. That was in the head. Damn it. Back off. Guy on the right. Nice. Got the headshot. Sometimes you just gotta tap fire it, get those easy kills. Oh no, there's a guy on my right. All right, now we play OBJ because I'm off my streak. I can't see. Ooh. Nice. All right, just got my left. Try to rotate here. Hello. There's that. Nice. 
Just gonna prone for a second, try to get my bearings here. Damn. A red dot on this might not be a bad idea either. Do hear a dog. Teammate. Ooh. I think this thing does that like crazy damage. Okay, that was actually <laughs> not very good. <laughs> Ooh. Bro, that dog was not where it was on the mini map. Whack. Try to come this way. There's one. No, wait. This guy just chased me to grab spikes. Oh, I didn't even hear him over there. We don't have a shield, which is unfortunate. But if I trophy up and just chill, should be good. But munitions right now because I can go overage on my ammo. Get another trophy too from that. Hell yeah. That kind of makes up for not being able to like put a shield down or anything. Where are they coming? <laughs> it's a shotgun, bro. Shotgun, by the way. Shotgun, by the way. No, they got in. Oh, I'm just going to trophy here and chill for a sec. Blind fire. Woo shotgun, by the way. Nice. Did my teammate get the other guy? Do you have a UAV? I'm going to go in. Try to get in the corner here. I'll try to get the scrap points off it. No. Yeah, the thing that sucks is you can't wall bang. I don't think FMJ would be able to make it wallbang either. I'm like 99% sure, but if somehow you could wallbang with this, that'd be so helpful. Hello. Oh! <laughs> oh, hello. Oh my God. He's got the point. This quarter? No, I had to push. I wasn't paying attention. All right, well, that game was not bad. We had to get a good win, but that one was not bad at all. Like we were on like an 11 uh, kill streak at one point. We we're getting long range kills. Like we're definitely showing that this is at least viable, maybe not broken, but even in my hands, which I'm not a very accurate person right now because I just haven't been practicing enough. It worked pretty damn good. I don't know. I think this is definitely at least viable for a video. So we're gonna we're gonna keep playing, see if we can get like a really good game. Oh, uh, slums, not high rise. Please not high. Dude, high rise would be the third one that I'd be like very pissed off about. Like my three least favorite maps probably. Well, I, I don't hate Crash, it just didn't fit. Some should fit actually pretty decently with this weapon and this playstyle. Insta C cap, you love to see it. We get aggressive. There should be a guy right here. Nice, there's one. Slide of hand is definitely a must with this, just because you're stuck with eight bullets, which can be really, really annoying. But with uh, slide of hand, it's not as bad because you can cycle through somewhat fast. <laughs> nope. That guy's trying to melee me. What are you doing, bro? That, and we're going to just probably watch this lane. Because I can just heady this and pop people. What? No! That guy's definitely a knifer if you saw his icon. Oh, that should have been a headshot. Cap, 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 cap. <laughs> I got him, nice. <laughs> but there's still those moments where you're in a fight and really would rather not reload. All right, let's play that B defense here. Um, Should we guys coming in here, I'd assume? Nice, there's one. Up this while I'm safe, hopefully. Oh, no! I will never not do that. Never not do that. No matter how much I play this game. Oh, or a mass. Oh, we're good, we're good. We repeat. Nice, there's one. Got a guy on B. Oh, you guys got him. That reload speed is so annoying. Ah. Nice, we're doing good. Gotta rotate here. Gotta get somewhere safe before I get shot in the back. And now I think we just try to press their spawn here. With the UAV. Got him. Martyr. Back off. Good head glitch this. Dude, this is a nutty head glitch. As long as I don't get behind you. Oh. There's a dog somewhere. I don't know where. Die, nowhere. Bro, it is so dumb that the dog doesn't show on the minimap accurately. So on B. Still on B. Nice teammate. What? Was that guy there the whole time? Oh, he was. I just had no idea. Luckily, when I wasted it earlier, it was like, it's a quick uh, operator skill. Okay, yeah. No, no, no hip firing with this build. You could change the it's a dog. You could change the um, attachments around a little bit, like the the laser to be a uh, hip fire laser. That would probably work pretty good, but I don't know. Or they just keep feeding me through this room. No one on my right. We're going for B. Nice, just one. Big guy coming here. Nice, just one. There's two. Got thumpered. Yep. Bro, put the thumper. Dude, this guy's killed me sitting in a corner thumpering me. 
every time I've died to him. Oh. Nice. Okay, I don't know what happened there. I don't like that. Oh, man, they got the B cap. We still win this, though, as long as they don't trip cap us. <laughs> Shotgun, by the way. Uh, this thing is nutty. Pop this real quick and then rotate around left. See if we can get something here. We also get points off that, which is awesome. Forgot about that. Get aggressive. Try to get on this head. He should be someone sitting here. Nope. One on my left. Oh, that guy's way over there. Headshot him. Headshot 73 somehow. Hello. <laughs> How are you going to let me do that to you? I see Carcass. This guy's about to push. Nice. Nice teammates. You guys got B. I'll just keep trying to spawn trap him. Because I can do that with this gun, which is nuts. Okay, well, I think that game show showed the capability of this well enough. I do think maybe you could tweak the build a little bit more and refine it. But the fact that you can hit people as far away as you can with this gun, it's literally just turning it into an AR. That's all it is. The only, like, the parts I don't like about it is, number one, the low amount of ammo. Number two, you can't wall bang and um, it's kind of hard to use, but if you're like good enough and you can aim well enough, then that's not a huge deal. But the first two, like no matter how good you are, you have to deal with those things. You just gotta be smart about reloading and whatnot and not, you know, wall banging people. So I don't know, definitely has a lot of potential. Definitely a really fun weapon. Uh, it, it, if anything, it's fun. Maybe not OP, but it's really cool. I'm happy this gun didn't end up just being a shotgun that's just like another echo or another striker or whatever. There's actually some variation to it. But yeah, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to drop a like and a sub down below. Thank you to Cobb Mobile for sponsoring today's video. And yeah, I'll see you guys later. Peace.